Well, over the past few years, we've all seen the videos online on social media of large groups of people breaking into stores, smashing windows, and taking off with armfuls of merchandise. Today, Governor Gavin Newsom signed 10 bills designed at making that a thing of the past. On Friday, Governor Gavin Newsom signed 10 bills designed to crack down on organized retail theft. The bills focus on auto theft, retail theft, and property theft. They allow, among other things, the ability for retailers to file restraining orders against repeat offenders. They require online retailers to gather information about the sellers in order to crack down on the resale of stolen goods, and they make it easier to prosecute car break-ins. These bills will strengthen existing laws. They'll enhance other laws. The tools uh, that these bills provide will provide for um, more cracking down on organized retail crime, more accountability, uh, more people being brought to justice. And so I think the collective message is clear. If you ransack our stores, if you attack our people, if you endanger our communities, we will come for you. But some, including San Jose Mayor Matt Mahan, have said that the bills don't do enough to confront some of the causes of retail theft, things like drug and alcohol abuse. The governor said on Friday that these bills are just the beginning of a push to deal with the problem. We're still working on a number of other bills. We still have more work to do more broadly in this space. But this is a demonstrable advancement of that collective effort. Now, the governor also said today that he opposes Proposition 36, which would increase drug crime and theft penalties. He's worried that that could lead to more mass incarceration. But for now, in the South Bay, Charles Clifford, Cron 4 News.